Archaeologists have found traces of houses, huts and pit houses in some sites. The first Neolithic site discovered in India was Burza home in Kashmir. The traces of pit houses had found at many places. Now children, what was pit houses? As you can see in the picture, pit houses dug in the ground. They were below the ground. The pits were narrow at the top and wide at the base. Some pits had a few steps leading down. Pit kept human warm from cold and safe from wild animals. The traces of ash of charcoal, pieces of pottery, chula that means ovens made of stone had been discovered in many sites included Kashmir, Pampur, Begagund, Olchibag, Pansgom, Brah etc. sites of India. The religious belief of Neolithic people. Early man believed in life after death. About 100,000 years ago, some people began burying their dead with great care. They may believe of life after death. Stone Age people may have believed the afterlife would be similar to life in this world. They used to feel that the per dead person is not dead, actually he is going to some other world. So, when they buried their dead, they buried the tools and uh, utensils along with the dead body. Sometimes dead were buried with humans or cattle, dog, sheep, goat etc. Thus they buried the dead in grave along with their weapons, pottery, jewelry, food, drink in the belief that these things were required after death. Buried means dafnana. Archaeologists have found the traces of burial sites under house floors or in the compounds of the people. So Allah, apart from this, they believed in other religious things also like they worshipped plants and animals as their ancestors and protectors. They also worshipped forces of nature such as the sun, the moon, stars, water, fire, rain, thunder, etc. Believing that they had special powers. They also believed in magical powers and charms and spells. Archaeologists have found the traces of paintings during the Neolithical period. People of Neolithical age used to paint animal figures, hunting scenes, tools on caves, walls, rocks or slabs of stone. Children, as we know that Stone Age had three periods, Paleolithic period, Mesolithic period and Neolithic period. By the end of Neolithic period, copper were discovered. Hence, Chalcolithic age or period started. Chalco means copper and lithic means stone. So, the Chalcolithic period was an era of transition between the Stone Age to Metal Age, that is, from Neolithic Age to Chalcolithic Age. The time period of Chalcolithic Age is 4500 BC to 3500 BC. This age is also known as Stone Copper Age. So, the first metal to be discovered was copper. And this age is known as or called Stone Copper Age because the tools, vessels, beads and many other objects were started made of copper and stone. Because copper were stronger than stone which led the development of early men more faster and easier. Children, Mehargarh is a site of Neolithic period which is a part of Indus Valley civilization like Harappa, Mohanjodaro etc. Earlier Mehargarh was in India but now it is in Pakistan. So let's watch the case study of Mehargarh. 
Mehargarh is one of the earliest agricultural site of the Neolithic period around 3500 BCE. It was founded in 1974 by the team of French archaeologists in Bolan Pass in Balochistan which is now part of Pakistan. It is one of the ancient sites with proof of agricultural proceedings in South Asia. The people in Mehargarh engaged in agricultural and sheep raising activities. Archaeologists have found many traces of farming and herding in this place. Archaeologists have also found the trace of development of terracotta and many other important findings including beads pendants ornaments and semi precious stones archaeologists have found the remains of houses that they were made up of clay bricks the houses were in square or rectangular blocks in which each house had four or more than four rooms as you can see in the site these are the pictures of actual sites of mehargarh archaeologists have found numerous burial places also as you can see in the picture again so stu so students let's recall the key points of the chapter the neolithic period is witness of many important developments such as development of agriculture invention of wheel which led the quick march of civilization invention of wheel led to many other inventions such as invention of potter's wheel invention of spindle for weaving cotton or woolen cloths development of carts etc <laughs> development of community settlements called villages new groups were formed known as tribes which led division of work between men and women domestication of animals in group specially rise of pastoralism innovations in pottery development of new agricultural tools neolithic religious belief in which buried beliefs are important neolithic paintings excavation of archaeological sites such as burj home in kashmir for pit houses burial sites and mehargarh site in pakistan so students hope you have enjoyed the chapter